This is Dr. Errol Courtney, personal identification number 64221B, recording from former unit Blackside, location 51 degrees, 30 minutes, 47.7 seconds north, zero degrees, eight minutes, 51.9 seconds west. Now into day 14,682, observing the time anomaly this site is built around, known as the time fracture. 30 minutes ago, both myself and Dr. Yates witnessed the fracture become active in a manner undocumented since observations began. As you can see from the readings, a huge spike in chronon and artron energy was detected radiating from the fracture. These are external readings, taken from the instruments monitoring the fracture at our laboratory. We hypothesize that the energy spike within the fracture itself is considerably higher. Unfortunately, we don't have accurate numbers to reflect the energy's output. You see, when they hit their peak, a flash of light emanated from the fracture, causing temporary distortion of all electronic equipment within the laboratory. Bad news indeed. When that light subsided, two things were observed. Number one, as you can see, the fracture itself is now considerably larger. And number two, this mysterious item that travelled through the fracture. Upon visual inspection, the item in question appears it's to be... His shoe. Thank you, Dr. Yates, but we don't know that. It's the left one. It's clearly one of his shoes. The item will now be thoroughly tested by the scientific team. Fortunately, a slow process, as due to cutbacks, we are woefully understaffed. The situation is not resolved. The fracture, since its first spike, has continued to slowly increase in mass, and the energy readings have leveled off at an 18% increase on the former baseline that's held for the last 30 years. Errol? Evelyn, not now. But it's Sorry. an 80% error. Evelyn, please, I'm recording. Two minutes. I asked for just two uninterrupted. I'm sorry. 80%. Both the chronon and archon energy readings have increased at the base by 80%. That's not possible. It must be another spike. Well, it can't be the base right read. I checked the baseline five spike. minutes ago. You're reading the wrong figure. Check again. Well, check the model again. It's right there. Right, check the model. Someone needs to find the cause of what's happening inside the time fracture. And that someone's going to be me. Don't forget to click below and subscribe to the official Doctor Who YouTube channel.